Hello friends, uh, today I would like to show you how a very small mistake can cost you an entire game. Um, this was a game uh, where I was playing with white. I, start, I started with e4, uh, black replied uh, e5, um, knight f3, knight c6 and bishop b5. So this was uh, Ruy Lopez opening and a6, so bishop a4. Um, f6, d4, so idea was to uh, taking control of the center uh, when uh, black captures my pawn. So knight takes d4, a knight takes d4 and pawn takes, e takes d4. Here um, queen takes d4. Um, b6, uh, the main move was uh, however b5 but Black misses it. Um, castle. B Bishop c5 attacking on the queen. So queen goes to queen d3. Uh, knight e7. c3. c3 because I would like to make a room for my bishop to uh, come on uh, c2 when there is an attack. Uh, and uh, black castles. Uh, bishop f4. Uh, knight g6 so uh, I would here at this position I would not like to tra exchange my bishop against the knight so uh, knight uh, so uh, here uh, it was g um, bishop g3 and then black attacked bishop uh, on b5 so bishop c2 here because see um, I have shown you in my previous videos uh, the attack was can be very costly if both bishop and queen are on the same diagonal and here I saw an opportunity where I would if this knight moves away and there is clear cut uh, chance of a checkmate here at h7 so this is what I have tried here um, um, bishop b7 I've d doubled the rook on uh, I've on d1, d1 and d5 but I would no I was not interesting in catch in just capturing this instead I moved e5 and what I was thinking when black spawn capture my uh, here pawn at e5 then I will try to sacrifice my bishop on e5 and as soon as um, uh, black's knight captured then it will be game over but uh, here the mistake of blunder made by black uh, he has given me this diagonal knight captures e5 and then boom queen takes e7 check checkmate here so friends let me know how would you like this video um, I hope you have learned something from this video of this of this blacks blender mistake try not to do this in your games take care till then bye bye